Hi guys, welcome back to Hermit Towns and Horses. I recently did a poll on my community tab asking which hermit crab topic you guys would like to see the most, and you guys chose how to tell if your hermit crab is male or female. So that's the topic we're going to cover today. So there are a couple myths out there saying that you either can't tell a hermit crab's gender or that you can tell based on how big their claw is, and those are actually not true. Before I tell you the easiest way how to tell if your hermit crab is male or female, first you need to know a little bit about hermit crab anatomy. So joining me today, I have one of my male and one of my female hermit crabs. This is my male, Ty, and my female, Belle. And they are going to be demonstrating for us today. All hermit crabs that are not missing any body parts will have 10 legs. The big claw is used to block the opening of their shell when they go inside of it, and the little claw is used for eating and drinking. Behind the claws, the hermit crabs have four other legs, or two sets, and these are just called walking legs. They're the ones that the hermit crab uses to crawl. The last two sets of legs that a hermit crab has are these ones in the back, and the hermit crab actually uses those to hold them inside the shell and help them to pull themselves into the shell when they want to hide. All right, so now that you know that a hermit crab has 10 legs, two pinchers, four walking legs, and four legs that keep them held inside the shell, I'm going to show you how to tell if your hermit crab is male or female. So the easiest way to tell if a hermit crab is male or female is that a female has these two little dots on the back pair of their walking legs. Here are the little dots. They are technically called gonopores and they will only be present on the female hermit crab's back pair of walking legs. So you can see them pretty well here on Belle. And then here is the male hermit crab tie and you can see that his back pair of walking legs do not have these gonopores. There are no little dots there and therefore this is a male crab. All right guys, so there you have it. This has been how to tell if your hermit crab is male or female. It's really not that difficult. Although I do wanna say if your hermit crab is new and it might be shy, it might be scared because it's in a new environment, it really won't be comfortable coming that far out of its shell. And I don't want you to be ripping it out of its shell trying to figure this out. I know it can be exciting when you get a new crab and you wanna know what their gender is so that you can name them. I promise if you give your hermit crab some time to settle in, it will eventually come far enough out of its shell for you to see. All right guys, that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it and learned something from it. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.